Action. Action. <laughs> Morristown, we're coming to you. Yes. Hello, Morristown, New Jersey. My name is Nicole Bergio. I am the co creator and uh, one of the artists on XOXO Moon Girl. I am so excited to bring XOXO Moon Girl to New Jersey. I grew up in New Jersey in Manalapin. I went to Manalapin High School and I never thought that I would get to perform in my in, in my home state. So I'm very excited. Um, yeah, Mel, can you tell everybody who you are? Hello, I am Mel. I am the musician, composer, uh, co-conspirator of XOXO Moon Girl. Um, I get to play with little doodads in the background and um, play music with Cole. And I'm super excited to bring this show to Morristown during a pandemic. Thank you, Morris Museum, for making it happen. This is our third summer in a row doing this show that um, is so uh, personal and challenging and healing and profoundly uh, sacred in, in both Cole and I's journeys as artists, as friends. Um, and I'm so excited to come back to the story three, uh, for the third time. Um, I know that both of us have grown so much as people, as artists, as friends. Um, and we're so excited to come back with our team and to revisit the story um, with a new lens. Cole, what yeah. are you excited for? I am so excited for, well, a thousand things like always, but for this show, I'm just excited. Um, well, like I was telling you earlier, Mel, I'm excited to, we performed at the Edinburgh Fringe Festival. We performed for a month straight, XOXO Moon Girl. And I think that profoundly changed us as performers. And I'm excited to bring that experience uh, and, and all of that knowledge that we learned there, doing that the show every night like that, uh, to this stage. I think it's going to feel different and incredible and exciting. And I can't wait to share the stage with you again. And, uh, you know, I was thinking about it and I'm also excited to be on a stage again during this time, during a time mm. of the pandemic, during a time of racial tension, during the biggest time in my life of an unknown, a real unknown, um, because I think that it fundamentally changes you as a person. Um, going through something like this, being in quarantine and seeing racial un, uh, injustice or tension or all of it play out before your eyes is different. It, 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 I know that those things have been there, but particularly with the pandemic, all of those things combined feel like they have fundamentally changed me as a person. Mm. Now I'm really excited to see what it feels like to be this person on this end of things saying the words of XOXO Moon Girl. And I know that the story is a bit sad. My story is a bit sad. Moon Girl's story is a bit sad uh, and quirky and funny. Uh, and I just kept coming back to, I thought that the show was important before this virus, before the pandemic. And I, I still believe that this story and the show is important now. And I couldn't think of a better way to uh, emerge from quarantine to emerge from a real place of isolation and the theme. Mm. So I'm very excited to share the stage with you and the people of Morristown. <laughs> there, you remind me, Cole, um, in this moment of racial uprising, you're right, this has been here um, for a very long time, since the beginning of our country. And I feel that this moment of reckoning, of national reckoning, of individual reckoning, is the, the fire that has always fueled our work it where, where what do we do in violence what do we do in healing how do we maintain joy how do we maintain resilience yes um, and so how do we find joy and resilience yes we're gonna channel that <laughs> also morristown i may have not, may or may not have been looking up your brunch spots um and the top 10 things to do so if you have any suggestions please leave them uh, yes, in the, on Instagram. Oh, yes. When I check out Morristown. 
We want to check out Morristown. Tell us all of your favorite places to eat. Where should we go? We're going to be hanging out in Morristown for one week. So we want to see the town for Ooh. sure. <laughs> so Thank you again from Moon Girl, from me, myself, Nicole, Melanie. Thank you from the bottom of our hearts. And we hope to see you there.